if I were in their shoes, I'd be thinking about other alternatives than striking oil fields. Look, the Israelis have every right to respond to uh, the vicious attacks on them, but the fact is that um, they have to be very much more careful about dealing with civilian casualties. When you have proxies as irrational as Hezbollah and the Houthis, and uh, it's, a, it's a hard thing to determine. The Israelis have not concluded how they're, what they're going to do in terms of a strike. That's under discussion. I think there are, if, if I were in their shoes, I'd be thinking about other alternatives than striking oil fields. Netanyahu may be trying to influence the election, and that's why he has not agreed to a diplomatic solution? No administration has helped Israel more than I have. None. 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 And I think uh, Bibi should remember that. And uh, whether he's trying to influence the election, I don't know, but I'm not counting on that. You've said many times recently that you want to speak to him, that you plan no, to. No, I didn't say plan to. I didn't say want to. You don't want to? No, I didn't say that. You're making it sound like I'm seeking and then uh, speaking. <laughs> I'm assuming when they make the judgment of how they're going to respond, we will then have a discussion. What I know is the plan that I put together received the support of the UN Security Council, and the vast majority of our allies around the world as a way to bring this to an end. One of the, look, the Israelis have every right to respond to uh, the vicious attacks on them, not just from the Iranians, but from the, everyone from Hezbollah to Houthis to, anyway. And, uh, but the fact is that um, they have to be very much more careful about dealing with civilian casualties. So how should they respond? You expressed concerns about attacks on Iranian oil facilities. How should they respond? That's between me and them. What are you considering imposing sanctions on Iran, and would you include oil in those sanctions? That's, a, so that's, be, that's under consideration right now, the whole thing. I'm not going to discuss that a lot. There's a lot we are doing. The main thing we can do is try to rally the rest of the world and our allies into participating like the French are in, in Lebanon and other places to t tamp this down. And, uh, but uh, when you have proxies as irrational as Hezbollah and the Houthis, and, uh, it's, a, it's a hard thing to determine. If you like this video, then like, share and subscribe to ET Now.